What's up, it's your boy Dynast. At the end of this video, make sure you go to www.dynastmere.com. Check out our indigenous African art, jewelry, fashion, and accessories. Also go to searchforhoover.com. Uh, learn more information on the documentaries we're shooting. Also contribute towards the documentaries. Last but not least, go to amazon.com, search your name Dynast Samir, buy a book. I wrote them, so support and buy one. I uh, wanted to shoot this video today. I want to first start off was on my um you know scrolling down my um my news feed on on my Facebook page and I noticed that um in celebration of Black History Month Cheap Aware brought on a uh, I guess a world renowned blogger black assistant named Gloria Atanmo and so basically what she did in honor of Black History Month she gave her top five favorite countries so I'm like, okay, this sister, you know, is going to at least shout out a couple black countries. So in honor of Black History Month, Gloria Atanmo does not give a shout out to any black countries. And I was just very disappointed. She named like Vietnam, Slovenia, Peru, Israel. She almost got it right with Cuba. You know, Cuba's technically not a black country, even though they took care of a lot of our black uh, political prisoners as far as allowing them to go on exile um, in their country, in Cuba. But Cuba's not a black country, unfortunately. You have some black people there, uh, but it's primarily white Cubans and mixed Cubans who call themselves mestizos. So for black, and to honor Black History Month, we have a black travel blogger instead of, uh, you know, making people or encouraging people or making people aware of all the beautiful black countries out there. She chooses five non-black countries as her favorite countries. And I was disappointed. At least choose South Africa or Jamaica or, you know, somewhere black. I mean, come on. So I was, that was just a missed opportunity. Because you know me, I would have shouted out the blackest countries on the planet. So I was disappointed in that. Um, but to get to my topic, you know, it's in, you know, to really go in on this, this trend I'm seeing on Facebook. You know, this melanin off fleet trend. You know, you traveling around the world to everywhere. Um, to every place that's a non-black country, but your melanin is on fleek. So your melanin is on fleek in Italy. Your melanin is on fleek in Paris. Your melanin is on fleek in Russia. Your melanin is on fleek in just about every non-melanin country. And if you go to a country where there's some melanated people there, they're getting treated like hell. I.e., you know, Gloria, she chose Israel. We know how the Habitian, uh, the the uh, uh, Falashian, the Black Ethiopian Jews, how they're marginalized and treated like crap in Israel. So you go in and say how your melanin is on fleek in countries where melanin people who reside there are being treated like shit. It is so counterproductive. So your melanin is on fleek in these racist countries. Where immigrants, black immigrants go to, i.e. Italy, i.e. Israel, where they go to, and because of their melanin, they're treated like shit, but your melanin is on fleek though. But one thing I noticed is the, the melanin, melanin on fleek, I travel to non-melanated countries, my melanin, my melanin is on fleek people, they never post that hashtag if they travel to a melanated country. And the reason why is because they got to compete with people, with black people whose melanin is more on fleek or fleeker than their melanin. They have to compete with people, with melanated people whose melanin is beyond fleek. And they don't want to compete with that. Because they know how melanated the other people, how, you know, I'm in, I'm, I'm going to tell you the most beautiful, most melanated country I've ever been to was Namibia. 
I mean, the, their skin was just beautiful and just black and just gorgeous. I've never seen melanin fleek like I did when I was in um, in Namibia. They had good skin, beautiful skin, beautiful white teeth. But the melanin on fleek, you know, I tr I, my melanin is on fleek in countries where there's no melanin or there's melanin in that country. It's being marginalized and they're facing racism. They will never say their melanin is on fleek in countries where there's abundance of melanin already there. That's the trend I'm noticing. You're a melanated goddess. You're a melanated queen in non-melanated countries. Why? How about travel to where there's nothing but melanin? Travel to black melanated countries. Throughout the Caribbean. Throughout Africa. Where you can meet other people who have beautiful melanin. And take pictures. And put that melanin on display. But because you, you know, you want all the glory... All the melanin, melanated glory. You want to bask in your so-called glorious melanated, um, you know, self. You want all the melanated glory to yourself. You will be the only melanated person in Ireland, and talk about how your melanin is on fleek in Ireland, in Dublin. You is the melanated queen, goddess, Nubian queen in Ireland. It's so backwards to me. So I had, I had to just get that off my chest. You know, you cannot be a melanated... You, you cannot travel and talk about how your melanin is on fleek in Russia, Ireland, Scandinavia, Nor Norway. You know, my melanin is on fleek in Norway. I mean, that just doesn't even sound right. I'm a melanated goddess, queen, Nubian of the earth. In Scandinavia. Like that don't sound right. You know my melanin is on fleek. In Vietnam. I mean. That, you know it's just. It doesn't flow. That shit doesn't go together. Keep your melanin on fleek. In Africa. Or black countries in the Caribbean. At least Brazil. You know. At least South Africa. Keep your melanin on fleek there. But again, I just, I find it odd and hilarious at the same time how your, you as a melanated queen, Nubian, natural hair sister, and your melanin is on fleek in Armenia. That shit just doesn't go. Follow me on uh, social media, search for who on Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, and Facebook. That is Samir. Till next time, I'm out.